Start off with G. Now you can play the G any way you want. Also with four fingers if you prefer. I'm going to use three. Onto the D chord. Just a normal D chord, nothing special. Make sure you mute the low E string or do not play it with your guitar pick. Onto C, start with your third finger. And with C, you always want to make sure you have the third finger right near the fret. So it sounds the best way possible. And those are all the chords of the song. Let's take a look at the strumming pattern. basic rhythm. Once more. So it's quite a long strumming pattern, covers two bars, and thankfully you don't have to play this song fast because it's a slow tune. G, it's nice to play a variation, only the ending is different. And that way we have a bit of variation at the end as well. Start from the top, here we go, two, three. G chord, and it's basically the same strumming pattern, but on certain points I just remove my second finger. And the thing is, you want to make sure you do not mute the fifth string with your third finger, because you, can't, because you want to hear it, you want to hear the open string. And the other thing is, you want to make sure you Aim for the fifth string with your guitar pick because that's where the melody is hidden. Next part. Here we have a D chord. And let's take a look at the other chords. Kind of a D7 here. Third finger at the fifth fret of the third string and first finger at the third fret of the second string. Then hold your first finger, second finger fourth fret, back to D, so it's lift off your first finger, first finger second fret of the fifth string, remove your second finger, and those are all the little chords there. Here we have the C. And you want to basically move your second finger at the second fret of the third string. And if you can, and that's difficult, also mute the fourth string. Then it's little finger at the fourth fret of the third string, which is a bit unusual in itself. Back, and lastly the C. So it's strumming. G. And here we have a pull off with the first finger at the first fret of the second string, and then first finger at the second fret of the third string. All are upstrums, so it's. 